Okay, so one thing I forgot to mention in the previous video is that you can zoom in or zoom out using the mouse wheel, okay? So you can use the mouse wheel to zoom in or zoom out. Alright, so now in this video what we're going to do is that we're going to add some physics to our game. Because right now if we play our game, nothing happens. Everything stays the same way. So what we're going to do is that we're going to select the bird and here we're going to add another component. So click here and add component in the inspector and let's type in rigid body 2D. So there's rigid body and there's rigid body 2D. Make sure you select rigid body 2D, okay? So select rigid body 2D and now if we hit play you will see that the bird is being affected by gravity and it falls, it falls down to the infinite. This is because this rigid body has a gravity scale of 1 and that's the reason why the bird falls down. But we don't want the bird to fall down through the ground. We want the bird to actually collide with the ground. We want the bird to be able to collide with the ground. So to do this, we need to give the bird a collider. So let's add another component and let's type in uh, capsule collider 2D. So now if you take a look, if you zoom in, you can see that the bird now has like a circle uh, surrounding it. Okay, so what we're going to do is that we're going to go to the capsule collider component and set a direction from vertical to horizontal and now you can see that it looks more like a capsule and it fits the bird quite nicely but one thing that we can do is that we can hit the edit collider button and now you can see that some some spots some little squares have appeared around the collider and we can just click on them and drag the collider like this so we can make the collider fit the bird a little bit better so like this it's perfect for now and now that we have added a collider to the bird, if we press play, you will see that the bird still, still goes through the ground. So why is this? This happens because the ground also needs a collider. So let's select the ground, let's add a component, and for the ground we will add a box collider 2D. So add a box collider 2D, and now if you zoom in, you will see that the ground has a, a green outline, the green border, which is the, the collider. Now we hit play, you will see that the bird collides with the ground. So we have added physics to our bird and we have added colliders to the bird and to the ground. So that's going to be for this video. I'll see you in the next video.